Hello everybody. Resented here, Necrodancer doing the daily. Now, I do... Oh my god, fucking immediately. I don't want to kill him yet because I want to get the multiplier. But here's the thing. Okay, so I, I wanted to talk about my schedule. Still no? Okay. So I feel like I've been... Hold on. <laughs> first things first. I've wanted to upload at least three videos a day. One daily challenge, one hard mode, one Aria attempts. It used to be that I would want to... Oh my god, yes! The game has granted me a beautiful bounty. But yeah, I've wanted... Um, I've supplemented uh, um, Isaac with more Necrodancer. Maybe that's not a good idea. Maybe I should diversify my content. But here's the thing. I I feel like like uh, the three video a day format is a little bit too much for my schedule. And so I was going to cut back to a two video a day schedule, which would include a daily challenge video every single day. And then... Uh, the other video would be staggered from, like, one day it would be, I, I need to do it. I have to, I have to do it. Yeah, and then, like, uh, the, the second video each day would stagger between uh, Aria attempts and hard mode. So, I'm, I'm probably gonna stick to that because recording three videos a day... Even, even if I, say, take my days off to record the backlog, which I do also feel like I should do that. Like, you know, use my... <clears throat> excuse me. My throat got very tickly. But yeah, anyways. Uh, like, I would use my days off to record, say, you know, f like four videos or whatever. You know, more, more if I have time. And then I would, I would use those four videos as a backlog so that the next four days I don't have to record an extra video. But sometimes I just don't have the time and I would sometimes just have to straight up record three videos a day. Which isn't very practical given my situation with uh, like... IRL work and I, sh I should have made the dragon open open this himself and now I gotta do it and honestly I guess for now oh oh hold on <laughs> I'll get back to that thought process that I was just on and let me just say what happened here I thought I would be smart and take one spell and the Crown of Thorns to heal up all the damage that I took, but stupid me forgot that Crown of Thorns additionally deals a half a heart of damage when you pick it up. So I took, I had, what was it, two and a half hearts, I took one heart of damage picking up shield, which meant I have one and a half hearts left. I picked up Crown of Thorns, which cost me one red heart, but it also dealt another half a heart of damage when when I picked it up. So it dealt one and a half hearts of damage total, which meant I got killed. Which also <laughs> adds another layer where if the dragon opened that uh, door up instead of me using the blood shovel, I would have been fine. So, I mean... <laughs> what can I say? I'm an idiot. Uh, not even five minutes in. Holy shit. Okay, well, th finishing up my, my thought process, um, recording three videos a day is, is, a little, is a little much. But if I spend, say, like an hour and 20 minutes recording two videos a day, that's a lot more manageable. 
and it might not seem like that much of a difference but you gotta you gotta realize you know each video is about 30 minutes long for a week that saves me three and a half hours of work like outside of what I'm already doing for like actual work and programming it saves me that much extra time which means a lot in the end so I might just stick to a two video a day schedule where I get a, a daily challenge done every single day and then the other day or the other video I just you know go on and off between aria and hard mode so since I'm going to do an aria run after this video I'm probably not going to play aria I kind of want to play like a melody run because I don't play melody that much I think she's a fun character to play I just don't play her a lot. So, I guess this is gonna be a, a fake daily challenge video because it's gonna be, you know, overrun with a melody run. I, I'm, I'm very sorry about that. I sincerely apologize. You, like, you might be irritated at the fact that my, my daily challenge runs, you know, occasionally end early like this. I don't mean them to end this early. If you're irritated, I'm absolutely livid. You know, I'm like, of all the people who's who's most annoyed, I'm the most annoyed. I hate it when this happens, trust me. Anyways. That being said, it's <laughs> it's it's hard to control, you know, something you just make You'd like to think you wouldn't make the same mistakes, but then, you know, after you play the game over and over again, just every now and then you're gonna make silly mistakes. It's just, for me, I make, I don't make mistakes every now and then, I make mistakes actually rather frequently, and maybe that's where the, maybe that's where the rub is with you guys. You're like, God damn it, why can't you just have, say, like, two days in a row where you have a good run? It's always... One decent run, and then fucking four days of shit. I hate it. Let's go ahead and use a bomb here. I'll take the boots. That protects me from ooze on zone 4, as well as... Ice on zone 3. Now there was, I did want to buy the, excuse me, my nose is very irritating right now. I did want to buy the backpack. That's the thing about Melody. You, you get like a more restricted item pool because she can't pick up weapons. So your whole game plan sort of changes. Also, she can't pick up damage. You have the same damage throughout the entirety of the of the run. So it, it switches your your run style to a more like utility based. Like you rely more on like consumables and armor and spells and weapons and damage go off on the wayside, mostly because you're not allowed to pick them up whatsoever. <laughs> But yeah, and health actually becomes more important because she starts with less of it. But all that is compensated by the fact that she has one of the most more powerful items in the game. Sure, I'll buy it. If the armor I had before was like any sort of plate armor, I I wouldn't pick up quartz, but I think quartz is it, it the the armor I would consider not taking quartz over starts at about like the the chainmail armor. Around the chainmail armor is where I start to start thinking that maybe I should. Uh, keep what I have. Also, you might hear my cat start meowing. I don't know what his problem is. I got home from work and I and I fed him. But apparently, I did not 
do enough for him because he's still meowing and being a general nuisance. Now here's the thing, I'm going to go back because I believe buying the cheese will allow me to survive just a little bit longer. I had half a mind to bomb the gold wall corner and like tunnel my way through to the to the exit just to save time but I'll go the long way but yeah the, I, maybe maybe I should be more aware of my of the items but I feel like since crown of thorns already takes half a heart Maybe the item itself should only cost half a heart on the blood shop. That's just that's just my my two cents. Or maybe the item is too good to only cost one heart total. Could get a glass torch. Again, I have half a mind to tunnel through, but I actually think that the the adjacent rooms are too far away, and that this the shop is is sort of holed off on its own little corner. I'll send this down. So I get a lovely bonus on the next floor. I gotta focus a little bit because... Playing as Melody is... Relatively different because... The weapon itself is is completely different than all other weapons, you know? You gotta... Like, not attacking enemies directly. I think it's unique to the the loot. I mean, the, the cat kind of plays with the idea, but... At least with the cat, you can still attack enemies directly, but... With the loot, it's like, you gotta do it this way. You can't do it any other way. That was nicely uh, timed. Not timed, but like... Yeah, no, that, that was a good time. It was on beat to the start of the the music. So I'll pick up that. That gives me a heart container, but I don't want to make the game easier. Also, it's interesting to note that the adjacent damage doesn't make barrels and crates move. So I want to get the I'm glad that it at least wasn't a... What was it? I'm glad it wasn't a... The, like, Ice Dragon Arena. The Ice Dragon Arena is actually horrible. I'll buy that. Or not buy that. I'll pick that up. I think that's way better than a level 1 torch that gives slight <laughs> bonuses. It doesn't even give a good bonus. It just gives you like like oh, you can see traps. I guess that lets you know where like the trap secret rooms are, but like other than that, that's not that much like this doesn't give you that much like extra insight on on the level. There 
we go. Now, I can try and get hit here. Ah, damn it. <laughs> I couldn't, I couldn't line the damn thing up properly. That's fine, though. Anything in here? Yeah, some gold. That's about it. Now, so far, so good. If only the... If only the fucking daily went this well. The one thing I hate about myself is... It seems like... It seems like the fucking... All the dailies where I get, like, good, good weapons, because there was an obsidian rapier, like, immediately. The, the, the first run where I, I get it, I die so quickly. I hate it. Like, if I can just, you know, and it seems like the most recent dailies... Oh. The most recent dailies, I've gotten like a gold weapon super early, but I've completely fucked over the 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 whole concept of surviving. I hate it. It's so irritating. It irritates me when I when I make mistakes like that cuz there's <laughs> there's no reason. I should I should know this. All right. I'm done deprecating myself. All right. Had to focus a little bit. I did lose out on a, a glass armored charge because I'm a silly boy. Nah. Okay. Had to focus a little bit, but I'm I'm back. Nothing down there. I do want to send this down the hole so that I can get a bonus on the next floor. Sure, I'll open it. Yeah, that's actually really good. I ate the cheese to get the my health from the uh, cursed hearts up, so I only have one healing item now, or I did have one healing item, so now being able to, oh, what the fuck, oh, of course. Lost one more glass armor charge. And I have one more. Oh, there it goes. It's actually, yep, scary because I got fucking cornered. Now I gotta not die. I had glass armor. Now I have one red heart, so... Oh, how the mighty have fallen. It would, I mean, it would, it would help if all the enemies weren't the hardest counterpart. That'd be nice.
Now I actually have to focus. And I hate that. <laughs> nah, no thanks. Because, god dang it, I like to play and I like to talk and I can't do both if I have to actually focus on what I gotta do. Oh my Jesus. A lot of spooky, scary enemies. Oh no, I don't go up, you big old goof. Thankfully, the, the heal plus the carrot kind of saved me from, like, imminent destruction. Nah. I do not like the courage shovel that much. Oh, of course. I fucked up, man. Whoa, okay, that was weird. You know what? Screw all these enemies, I'm just gonna go. Oh god, oh god, don't get cornered, don't get cornered. That's how the that's how they win. Oh that's how they win. Go over here. Oh, I've done it, boys. And I love the fire version of this song, and I fucking missed it because I had to go into the damn fucking ice zone to not die. So now I'm fucking salty at the game. Because I, I actually... I know A-Rivals... Remixes get a lot of shit, but god damn it, the... 3-2 fire zone is, is lit, dude. I missed it. It, um... Like, by itself... I think it's fine. But it really... Shines when you're... Playing the game. Because it flows well with melodies. Like, sort of... Rhythm... <laughs> it's, it's gonna sound weird when I say this. But, like, rhythmic... Um, like playstyle, like how she has to move. You know, she has to like uh, juggle, juggle with the enemies to hit them. It's nice, and it fits her character very well. And now I'm just you know making up any excuse to stay in the fire zone because I, I like it. No, I'm just gonna go look. I'm gonna take a small detour. Just enjoy, man. Is it not dope? Am I just... Am I going... Am I mad? But no, I think it's dope as hell. Also, this one's a little hard to... Get the beat on, because it's like so relatively quiet yes and yes now I gotta be extra careful one bad thing about melody is the you gotta be very careful with enemies because you only deal one damage. Now, the one thing I would love would be... Like, plate armor. I would absolutely love plate armor. I got the gold. I, I'm pretty sure it's 1400. Like, base? So, you know... 
Like, I'm not cheap, game! Aw, oh, damn it. You know, game, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not cheapskate. I got the, I got the, the moolah. If you'll just let me buy it, you know? Just murder, murder them. I think Zone 3 is one of the harder ones on Melody because you can easily get swarmed. Just back and forth, back and forth. Oh, idiot, that doesn't count as moving around. I'm an idiot. Oh, that's a big in spiders. I don't think I've actually seen a big spider. How do they work? How are you supposed to... I was gonna say, how are you supposed to hit them, but... I guess that works just fine. I guess I'll pick up the Ring of Protection. It does substitute a little bit of the lack of armor <laughs> that I have. Also, with the way that you constantly have to move around enemies, it's hard to tell where they'll end up after you. Yeah. Like, stop hitting them. Yeah. Oh god, yep, just like that, boy. I keep losing my multiplier because I don't know where the enemies are gonna be. <laughs> Done. Oh, this shit again, alright. I'm taking it this time because I... It's not gonna kill me. Also, this is also fucked because... Damn! The, the the mages, they 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 block the place, and so if you hit them, you get teleported, which normally always means you get you get hit. I can also use the shopkeeper familiar to heal. There we go. It gets a little tricky with the damn sorcerers. Yeah. All right, what do we got? No! I'm still salty about the damn daily challenge. I can't even stand to look at the blood shovel. Wait, was it the blood shovel that I got the... That I got the... Oh god, just move. Or was it the... No, there was no last run, was there? I played the daily and then I played... A, a melody run. So it was... No, wait. Hold on, now I'm... No, I... I died as... Who the... Am I losing my fucking mind here? Where did I have the blood shovel? It wasn't the daily. It was a run that I played... That I died on. I don't know. No, it was the daily. I remember this 
vividly in my brain. I s I was so fucking caught up on the fact that that I suppressed I suppressed the daily like knowledge from my brain cuz it definitely was the daily. Oh. Oh, thank god. Oh god. Yeah, it <laughs> Now that I think about it, and I remember, it definitely was the daily. Anyways, now that that mystery has been solved, I'm still salty about the damn... About the damn daily that I don't want to take... That I didn't want to take the blood shovel. Why'd I... What the fuck? So that's why I stuck with the... Well, also, I think I like the Obsidian Shovel more. I like the Obsidian Shovel more, but from a daily perspective... Uh, idiot. From a daily perspective... The blood... The blood shovel's better. Also, the diagonal shit... Throws me through a loop every time. Oh, it's like crazy dubstep. I actually have not heard this version before. So I'm gonna like sit around a little bit just to listen to it. I have not heard a rival's version. It's not that bad. It's a lot less uh, intense than Danny's. And it's a lot, lot less intense than <laughs> Family Jewels. I mean, it kind of gets it kind of gets crazy once the uh, like when he drops the he drops the fucking the nuke after he like goes like Hua! also I have not heard this version either so it's nice to hear different people's version other than just Danny B's and. Family Jewels. So I'm gonna explore just a little bit so that I can hear the music. Just to get a an understanding. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. Yeah, not bad. I still think Danny B sort of Danny B like nailed amplified music. It's hard to top. Family Jewels comes very very close with his remixes, and A Rival's style isn't necessarily um my cup i wasn't gonna say my cup of tea but like the the kind of music he makes is uh not the sort of electronic music that i typically listen to i'm not accustomed to like the kind of like um uh, 
not loose, but like easy style, and then it just sort of drops and gets really, really hard. It's interesting, to say the least. But it's typically not what I would listen to. Not to hate on the man. He makes some um, pretty ball and tracks. Oh god. I have been I have been cursed. What does this do? Do I die if I take that? We have to try for science. I I do not die. Do I gain strength? Is this a way to deal more damage? We have to see now, right? Can't see there. Give me an enemy with more than fucking... No, you do not gain damage. It also does not deal extra damage if you're... If you're just hitting it. I'm also slowly gaining my HP back, so... The only thing Shovel of Strength is useful for is... Like, knocking out multiple walls. So I guess that's why it's still in her pool. Because it can do that. But you gain no bonus damage. Which makes sense. I think, um... I think the loot does have a sort of a... Like, mechanism in it to prevent you from gaining more damage. Or, maybe it, uh... Like, you can gain damage just fine, but it's like, you know, when the game, or when the weapon registers that you hit something, it, uh, it just makes it one damage no matter what. Oh god, I gotta, I gotta kill him! There we go. So, like, it could be like, yeah, so you do, you do deal, you do deal three damage, but, uh, you have this weapon, and so it only registers, you know, one heart, no matter what. I feel like this music's gonna get, gonna get hard. It's gonna drop, isn't it? it? I still feel it. Oh, it's happening, boys. Hmm. Is it still gonna get hard? Has the time passed for hardness? No, I think it's just gonna stay like this. Nothing wrong with that. I just thought for sure it was going to like sort of drop, you know? Ah, oh, damn. Damn tempo. What have I done? Oh my god, that was... That was scary. I have somehow survived without taking so much as a scratch. I am not letting you hit me again. You hit me once. I lost no health. I plan on keeping it that way. Oh, I took both items. Okay. I'm just sort of surprised that the... Like, he didn't go sort of all out on this song, considering it's like, you know, the, like the culmination of your, of your run. It's quite alright. I enjoy it nonetheless. Let's move on. Also, is this... This sounds just like regular old Danny B. Oh my god, help. 
Did A Rival not make a remix of this song? Oh god. Oh, you're done, boy. Cause this this just sounds like the normal song. Right? All right, let's 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 finish that out. So that was that was good. That was an interesting melody run. <laughs> this was basically a fake Necro Dancer daily challenge and video, and it was instead just a regular Necro Dancer let's play, but with melody. So yeah, I'm again, I'm really sorry about that very bad melody run or pff, very bad daily challenge. I, it really didn't occur to me that what hap what happened would have happened. So I apologize again. But anyways, I still hope you enjoyed the video for what it's worth. Um, if you did enjoy the video, then please show your appreciation by liking, commenting, subscribing, all that garbage. And I will see you guys next time.